Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome to episode 3 of Fortnite 101, where today we're going to be covering the fastest way to learn 90s for beginner keyboard and mouse players. But don't worry, the best thing about this tutorial is that it's going to work for whatever input you're using, so if you're on controller or on keyboard and mouse, this guide will teach you how to learn 90s the fastest way possible, and you will soon be able to master them within just a few days or even just a couple hours of following this tutorial. And without any further ado, let's jump right into it. All right, guys, jumping right into the video, I just want to clear this up that 90s will be quite difficult for you as a beginner player. They were really hard for me as a beginner, and it took me actually about three weeks to nail them down. But I guarantee you guys, if you follow this tutorial, you can have them nailed down within a couple hours or even maybe a day or two if you're going like really slow and trying to really learn it. But I guarantee you guys with this tutorial, you can learn them super quickly. So let's jump right into it. Now let's clear up what your 90s are probably going to look like as a beginner player. Let's be honest, your 90s probably look like this right now. You're just putting two walls and a ramp because I know this is exactly what I was doing as a beginner player. And there are some very, very bad things that go along with these 90s. Not only are these 90s very weak and easy to shoot down, you can actually miss and you get caught under the ramp and it pushes you down and then you have to like build out and then you have to go ahead and redo the 90s completely and it's just a whole mess mess so before you even start getting in the habit of doing 90s like this we gotta learn how to do them the right way and now with all that being said this is the best way to do 90s as a beginner player so what you guys want to do is you want to start off just by placing a ramp very easy just the start of the 90s process and then what you want to do is put a wall behind here you want to put a wall right above that so you're gonna have one wall behind the ramp and then you're gonna have one wall right above the ramp here you're gonna look over to the right hand side you want to put a wall right at the top here and a wall right at the bottom so as you can see there's two walls here and then two walls here two at the bottom and two at the top and you're standing on the ramp and we're almost done the 90 you just want to jump and you want to place a floor and then jump and then place a ramp and you've successfully done 190 and then what you want to do is just continue that cycle so put one wall right at the top here and then you want to look off to the right hand side put a wall right at the top and then look down and put a wall here jump place a floor and then jump place a ramp now the reason that we're going so slow is so that you actually get used to the keys you need to press in order to do a 90 and doing 90s really slow helps you build your muscle memory and it helps you give your brain time to process what you're doing therefore making your muscle memory way better because you're really giving your brain time to process exactly what you're doing how you're meant to do it and then with time you're eventually going to get faster and faster at doing 90s but the slower you go the more you learn the better you'll become at doing 90s and you'll know how to do them properly so that when you're actually starting to go really fast doing 90s you'll be doing them the right way instead of doing them the incorrect way like I showed you at the beginning of the video with the two walls and the ramp you don't want to do that at all. So taking it slow is the key to learning anything in life, but specifically in Fortnite, for example, if you're trying to learn like a high ground retake, but in our case, we're trying to learn how to do 90s, taking it slow and really, really giving your brain time to process exactly what keys you're pressing, how to use the keyboard, what sequence of keys you need to press in order to complete a 90, going really slow really, really, really helps with that. And then eventually with time, you're going to be able to see some major improvements in the speed of your 90s and obviously I knew how to do 90s before this but like you're gonna be able to do 90s like this fast within maybe an hour or two of you just practicing going really slow I promise you guys it's honestly insane how well this 90s tutorial works and it, it works for so many other people I actually used this exact strategy in my video that got 270,000 views and you guys said it helped you out so much and I really wanted to just bring this into a very short video for you guys so that you had this knowledge at your disposal just in case you didn't want to scrub through my entire 10 minute long video and I'm not gonna lie that's really all we have to practice for doing 90s it's really that simple guys and I really hope my video is able to help you guys out and I hope you all have an amazing day and I'll see you in the next one